Hello everyone and welcome to a very special Halloween edition of Arcadia. Today we're going to be going around to everyone's houses, so you, I don't know if you've seen any other videos, hopefully you have, but today you'll get to see everyone else's houses because we're going to go and leave some treats for them. I hope that if you are trick-or-treating tonight, you have a very fun and safe time, and if you're going to party, like me, you also have fun, but stay safe and be smart <laughs> so we are going to make pumpkins because we have installed the pumpkin carving mod so each person today is going to get their very own carved pumpkin by me and we're going to leave them some cookies as a treat um we have just about everything we need i need to go down to the farm and get some more wheat and cocoa beans so that we can make some cookies so we will go ahead and, is that how you do it? Oops, upside down. All right, here we go. Cookie jars. Maybe we have some leftover cookies, ha <laughs> So I, I have my pumpkins already. Hopefully I have enough shears. We will hop over to spawn and then we will go adventure from there. Alright, so the first people we're going to go to is Scott and Phoenix because they are right next to each other. Alright, so here's Scott's house, greeted by little Wolfie. Hello. Um. His house is really awesome. He kind of gave me inspiration for my newest house. Alrighty, so what we're gonna do first is set down a pumpkin. Oh, actually, a jack-o'-lantern. Ooh, and then when you click the shears, it zooms in. Check that out. Whoop. So for Scott's, we're going to carve. Oh man, I didn't carve pumpkins in real life this year, guys. I don't, I don't know what I'm doing. Let's give him a surprise look. <laughs> yeah, that looks that looks like something. <laughs> and let's leave him a cookie jar on top. Boink. Where's the cookies? Do I have to put the cookies in it? Oh man. All right. So no tricks, just treats. Happy Halloween! Oh, it almost fit. Love, Brit. Just do Brit. Yay! Pumpkin number one! Alright, next we'll head over to Phoenix because she's literally right across the street. Where should we put hers? We'll put it over here in front of her house. Pro tip, guys. Don't carve jack-o'-lanterns of pumpkins because this is hard. I don't even know what it looks like. Does that look creepy? I mean, it looks something. <laughs> Love, Brit. Alright, now we're gonna head over to Cheeb and Melissa's house because they still kind of live in the same place, I think. They also are... yes. Oh, and Monica's right there too, so we'll hit all three of them. Alrighty guys, here we are at Monica's house. Her house is the most magical and fairyland house. It's so cute, I love it so much. Aw, Phoenix left her a gift. We'll go ahead and leave a little pumpkin right next to it. You know what, I think we're gonna go steal some pumpkins so that we don't have to carve jack-o'-lanterns anymore and make it a little easier on us. So I will be right back. Normal pumpkin, yay! So we will carve her. What will we give Monica? Let's put a little heart because we love her so much. How's that? That's not too bad. And then I think we just click it and yeah, now we have that's how it should be. Let's give her some cookies. Oh, it's so cute. Now that we're done with Monica, we're gonna take a little nap because it's nighttime out. And then we'll head over next door to Cheep's house. All right, welcome to Cheep's house. 
Eve and Melissa live here in their tiny little hut of awesomeness. <laughs> Look at their high class furniture. Good going guys, gals I mean. Okay, we <laughs> we'll just plunk it right there I guess. Alright, so we wrote high because we're super original like that. Doink! <laughs> and we'll put a torch inside. Yay! Oof, there is no room for this. <laughs> Alright, hopefully they know that that is for both of them. They each get two cookies. Well, I guess we'll go see CPK because he is actually the closest. And then it's going to be quite a journey to get to everybody else. Oh, we got dinner bone back! Yay! <laughs> All right, Dinnerbone, do you want to be the guardian of the pumpkin? Uh, where's the front door? Oh, it's down here. I don't think he's been on here in quite a while either. Arcadia people, come back! <laughs> the sound is so cute. All right, let's fill him with treats for Halloween. And yes, everyone's sign says the same thing because I am just that original. <laughs> Okay, the closest from here, I believe, is Joel and Lizzie. Yes, everyone's thousands of blocks away. Oh, he's- oh, man, there's Scott's house. Literally, right next to Scott. Oh, Alright guys, we will go off on our journey. I will see you when I arrive. Alright guys, we made it without anyone taking our candy. Ooh, is that a firefly? so pretty. Joel has been to the twilight. What's it? The twilight forest. Oh, I'm so jealous. And I know that they already have cookies, but you can never have too many cookies, right? All right. Joel and Lizzie have a super cool pumpkin. So let's put their cookies down on their cool guy. I kind of actually like the sunglasses. It's kind of cute. <laughs> All right, guys, we're almost done. All we have left is Yami, Lauren, Lorixia, and Mike, and then we will be done trick-or-treating on this Hallow's Eve. Ooh, that's right. He slayed the Hydra. If you guys haven't checked out Joel, which I don't know why you wouldn't have already, but uh, he, yeah, go check out his videos. They're, he's been doing a lot of cool stuff. I love these crystals. That's so awesome. Ooh, we might be decorating. Oh my gosh, look at these candles. Oh. All right, Lizzie, come help me decorate. <laughs> we'll take a little snooze in the bed because purple. I love purple. All right, everyone else is over that way, so I think we're gonna pop home and see if anyone is much closer. Oh yes, everyone is way closer to me. So let's go hit Lorixia and Michael first because they are the closest. Look how cute Rixia's house is. I just love it. Cute little mushroom. Oh no, I messed up. My eyebrows are touching my cat wings. Well, hopefully she knows that this is a pretty girl with some pretty makeup and lipstick on. Alright, so there's Rixia's. She's got... I messed it up a little bit, but it was a cute little kissy face. Her eyebrows kind of blended into her makeup, but that's okay. We'll just pretend that never happened. Alright, I'm not sure if you guys know this or not, but Michael lives up on a floating island. Zesty Mike, sorry. And he hasn't really been playing much on the server. He built his house and then he was kind of done with it. But this place is awesome. He's got, like, the ladder is in the tree. The tree is part of his house. He obviously never finished it, but I won't say if I did or did not help build most of it. <laughs> But we'll go ahead and leave him a nice little pumpkin and we'll be really sappy. All right, I love you. I'm gonna try and go down here and let you guys see how cool his place is. Ready? Geronimo! Blank. <laughs> Look how awesome that is. That tree is ginormous. All right, here we are at Yami's tree house. It's really big and really awesome. I've actually never been up in there. I've just watched some of her videos. So hopefully if we put the pumpkin, yeah, we'll put it right here by our stairs. She'll see it. Hopefully nothing spawns while we're trying to carve a pumpkin. 
But we... Oh, is there a kitty? We just heard a kitty. <laughs> Distractions. That's really funny, though, because we're actually going to give her a little kitty face. Kitty whiskers. I done goofed. That's the ugliest, <laughs> derpiest cat I've ever seen. <laughs> Let's just go for it and give it some more whiskers. <laughs> oh, I'm so bad at pumpkin carving. <laughs> Derpy kitty pumpkin is done for Yummy. I'm going to take a quick tour inside. If you guys want to see her house, you're going to need to go check out her videos. But I'll see you over at Lauren's house. Alrighty, and last but not least, we are at Lauren's house, and we're going to leave her pumpkin right by her bed. So when she logs on, it's the first thing she sees. Alright, for Lauren, I was going to do a ghost, which it still kind of is, but it kind of turned into more of a Pac-Man ghost. But that's okay. I think she'll still appreciate it. <laughs> Alright guys, well we are all done trick-or-treating for the night. It's time to head back home, get our house ready for Halloween, and get ready for the trick-or-treaters who might come over to our place. Alright everyone, thank you so much for joining me today for Halloween. I hope that you all have a fantastic Halloween. I hope that you get lots of candy and have lots of fun. I will see you in the next episode. Bye bye Oh my gosh. Chair, what are you doing? Chair! Why? What are you doing? No! I just want you to work. I need help. Somebody please help me.